All right. Hey, everyone. Um, still dark here, so um, just uh, keeping keeping things like this. Um, so we are on day 81 from the voice of the martyrs. Psalm 73, 25, and 26. Whom have I in heaven but you? And there is nothing on earth that I desire besides you. My flesh and my heart may fail, but God is the strength of my heart and my portion forever. Have you been struck by how the members of our persecuted family are totally enamored with Jesus? He is truly their all, the whole of their lives, nothing but him, their everything. One little word, all, expresses a lack of nothing and the inclusion of everything. <clears throat> in reading the stories of our family of God, have you pondered if you could respond in similar life-threatening situations with affirmations of faith? Our brothers and sisters would tell us, simply look to Jesus. He is truly all you need. When Jesus is our all, he will provide all we need. We don't need to project into the future or wonder if we are prepared. In the presence of Jesus will come what we need just when we need it, even as we live and face the pressures of life. The key is to live our lives now in the all of Jesus, and he will be all to us in whatever our future holds. In Jesus, our all, comes the courage we need. In Jesus, our all, overflows more jo joy than we can imagine. In Jesus, our all, is strength for the fiercest opposition. In Jesus, our all, is comfort for every sorrow. In Jesus, our all, is contentment in every circumstance. In Jesus, our all, is every need met that he deems needful. In Jesus, our all, we can, with confidence, live and move and have our being. In Jesus, our all, is the hope of this earth and the high hope of heaven. And amen, and amen, and amen. Going deeper. Sing or say the words to the chorus of this hymn written by James Rowe, and then write a prayer or psalm of praise to Jesus, your all. All that I need, he will always be. All that I need, till his face I see. All that I need through eternity, Jesus is all I need. <clears throat> Jesus are all. We could ask for no more than you. Help us see you as our all like never before. Nothing do we lack with you as our all. Nothing can be added to your completeness to make you more or greater. You are all. You are all gracious, all compassionate, all loving, all forgiving. In you as our all, we are complete. No straining, no reaching, no grasping for anything. We have all that we need in you. And out of your fullness, we pray that you will see us as we follow you. Thank you, dear Jesus, for being our all. Amen. Okay, so I will end it there for day um, 81, and I will see you in the next video. God bless.